What body systems remove toxins from the body? That is a great question. If you've been on a quest to start decreasing toxins in your body, you may have wondered this very process. If that's you, then you're in the right place. I'm gonna share all the details with you, so let's get started. Hi, I'm Dr. Kelly Shockley, doctor of cause, chiropractic, board certified in sports medicine, and specialized in clinical nutrition. In this video, we're gonna go over the four primary toxin removal systems in your body. Then we're gonna cover the most common mistake traditional medicine is making in an effort to help you. And finally, I'm gonna be sharing with you the most crucial lifestyle variable that amplifies or destroys your ability to detox. Let's dive right on in. Okay, it's a mouthful, but what are the four primary toxin removal systems of the body? A key component for understanding this is that these systems have to be working in harmony together in order for your body to actually fully detox. So system number one is the disposal of cellular waste products, predominantly lactic acid. Number two has to deal with the larger waste products that are removed from your lymphatic system. Those smaller ones actually will go through your vein and be disposed of via the liver or exhaled through the respiratory system. Number three is the processing of toxins by your liver. Once this is achieved, it, the liver dumps the bile into the digestive tract. And oftentimes there's components of this that's made water soluble that'll be excreted via the kidneys and through the urine. And then number four is the final clearance by your digestive tract. That would be the bowel movements on the other end. So these four systems have to work in harmony for your body to actually achieve its ability to detox. Now I'm curious, did you know that these were the main systems within your body that are involved in eliminating toxins? Let me know your answer down in the comments below. Now, what is the most common mistake that traditional medicine is making in an effort to try to help you out with this process? Well, the easiest, most common answer is that they deny that this is even a thing. Okay. They also don't test for toxins. So if you're not testing for it, how would you even know that it exists? There's a, a lot of lacking of understanding and knowledge of this whole realm. The other side of it is they may, they might have an idea, but they don't recognize all four systems for your body to be able to eliminate. And then going back to the testing, if they don't know the systems, they don't know how they can actually test and determine if your body's doing a good job. And then it's not their fault, but the system that they're stuck in has compartmentalized medicine. And it, that also disables them from being able to really evaluate for this issue. Now, before I get into the most crucial lifestyle variable that is either going to amplify your ability or destroy your ability to detox on its own, I just want to take a moment and remind you to click that subscribe button down below, turn the notifications on, and give me a big like while you're down there. I appreciate it. I am producing videos regularly, helping you know how to actually eliminate toxins, you know, how to improve overall health and well being, and ultimately help you be able to take back control of your life so you can live life to the fullest and achieve what I like to call total body mastery. So, again, just click that subscribe button down below, turn the notifications on, and give me a big like. I appreciate your support. Now, what is the most crucial lifestyle variable that affects your ability to detox? it is sleep. Sleep time is, think of it this way. It's when your body goes into house cleaning mode. And if you're curious on if you're doing a good job with this or not, how you feel when you wake up and how much time it takes for you to feel energized and ready to take on the day is telling you exactly all you need to know. If you wake up and you're droggy and you have to reach for a cup of coffee before you even feel like, you know, stepping into reality, you're probably not doing a really good job cleaning up house and it's going to show up in all realms of your health. So I would encourage you to figure out how to sleep better. There's so many different tips out there anymore. Now I've got previous videos teaching you how to actually improve your sleep. So make sure you look for that. Now, if you've tried a lot of the classic things of like sleeping in a dark room, making sure your um, temperature is at an appropriate level, you know, decreasing brain clutter before you go to bed, sleep or uh, stress reducing strategies. If you've tried all of those things and you're still not being able to sleep at night, or maybe in conjunction with that, you're concerned about toxins, 
you probably want to figure out why you're not sleeping and do you really actually have a toxicity issue? You know, you could assume you have a toxicity issue and maybe that's part of why you're not actually sleeping at night. But to truly understand and know, you need to be able to evaluate your whole entire health. And that is not something you're ever going to get accomplished through traditional medicine here in America. But don't worry. I've got the answer for you. All you need to do is go down to the description below this video, click on it so it expands, scroll down, look for the health workshop, click that link, sign up, and I will teach you all you need to know on how to take back control of your health, how to determine are you like detoxing or not, how to figure out why you're not sleeping at night, and so much more about your health specifically for you. By the end of the workshop, you'll know exactly what you need to do and what your path is for achieving total body mastery. I can't wait to see you in the workshop and I look forward to seeing you on a future episode. God bless.